Welcome to News 3, I'm Kurt Williams. Topping our headlines, the deadline for all active duty sailors to be fully vaccinated against COVID has come and gone. Meanwhile, those in the selected reserve have until December 28th. The Navy says those who refuse the vaccine without an exemption will be administratively discharged. And those who are separated from the Navy only for vaccine refusal will receive no lower than a general discharge under honorable conditions. But the Navy says that type of discharge could result in loss of some veterans benefits. Virginia Beach police have arrested four suspects accused of stealing the car and then crashing it into a gas pump. It happened Saturday morning. Reports say four people tried to steal a car from the parking lot of the Wawa on Northampton Boulevard. When the owner confronted the suspects, police say they stole another car and then crashed it and ran away. The young men were found and charged. Police also recovered five guns, two of which were stolen and two more stolen cars. The suspects are between 18 and 21. They're facing a number of charges, including grand larceny and credit card theft. Time now for a check on our forecast with Chief Meteorologist Patrick Rocky. Well, hi, Kurt. It is a chilly forecast, at least as we head towards your Tuesday morning. Some of us are going to wake up to a little frost on the windshield as temperatures dip into the upper 20s and the lower 30s. So a frigid start to the day, but by the afternoon, we're back to where we should be for this time of the year in the mid to upper 50s under partly cloudy skies. And that warming, warming trend continues. The first day of December on Wednesday, 61 degrees as our forecast gets even warmer as we head toward Thursday and Friday. We're talking about temperatures in the mid to upper 60s. Some areas may even touch the 70 degree mark, believe it or not. Looks like a mild start to the weekend on Saturday with a mixture of clouds and sunshine, but dipping into the upper 40s again on Sunday and a chance for rain by Monday. That is a look at your first warning seven day forecast.